Now let's understand how to restore a SharePoint site. As we discussed earlier, when you delete a SharePoint site, that site is retained under deleted sites for 93 days. If you do not restore a site within 93 days, all the site content and site settings are permanently deleted. Also, when you restore a SharePoint site, all the site content like document libraries, files and folders within document libraries, site list and list items are also restored along with this site. And in case of a team site, when you restore a team site, the associated Microsoft 365 group is also restored. So first, let's restore a communication site. So this is a communication site. You will select this site. You will go to deleted sites, select this site and click restore. So now this is restoring this site. Site is restored. Let's go back to active sites and look for news. So now we have this site here. Let's open this site. This site is up and running and it is working properly. Now, likewise, if you want to restore a team site, the process is same. But first, let me show you the Microsoft 365 group for a team site. So this is the team site, ABC team site three. And this is the Microsoft 365 group under deleted groups. Now, when I will restore the team site, this particular group will be restored as well. So let's go back and select this site, restore, restore. Let's go to active sites. We can see the team site here. This is restored. Let's refresh here. It might take some time. So the group is restored as well. Let's go to active groups and we can see this group here. Now there is one more scenario. We know if we restore a team site, the associated Microsoft 365 group is also restored. But if you do not restore the team site and you restore the group first, this will not restore the team site. You need to restore the team site manually. So this is how you can restore these sites in SharePoint Admin Center.